What's up guys? So this video is a little bit different than normal so I just want to throw an update out at the beginning. I'm going to try to keep this under 30 or 45 seconds because I don't want it to be like half the video before we actually get to what the video is about. But so for anyone that's wondering about some of the other series we do on this channel or we have done in the past and kind of fallen off, uh, stuff like uh, the shiny badge quest and the Charmander hunt, those should be coming back soon. The only reason they haven't happened is uh, recently is because my capture card for that system's been wonky um, So I've been working on that trying to get it fixed the videos fuzzy the audios not great So I don't want to like stream that or record that if it's not going to turn out very well And one other thing I want to throw out there about this video while I was originally doing the edit on it I realized there is a massive glare on the cards half the time. I'm really sorry about that um, You know, I just didn't know exactly how to frame everything um, so if I do do another one of these in the future, don't worry, I'll try to figure that out. I'll make sure that, uh, you know, you guys can see the cards the entire video. Uh, thankfully, most of the cards, especially the, the good ones, they do show up well. But yeah, so I'm recording this after I already recorded the whole other thing. Obviously, I've been editing it and stuff. Uh, so I'm going to introduce the video in there. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. What's up, guys? Welcome to this video, which should be a first on the channel. Of unboxing some Pokemon cards so in front of us we have a Shining Legends Elite trainer box and before I even get into this guys I'm just gonna go ahead and give a slight disclaimer of I've very recently gotten back into Pokemon cards uh, last time I was into it was when I was really little around Gen 3 so there's a lot of stuff that's been introduced to it and even stuff that's been in it since back then that I didn't fully understand um, that you guys may know about that I am not quite uh, properly versed in. So with this box, if there's some cards I that you know I should be really excited about, or I really shouldn't be too excited about, um, and I you know react the way that you don't think I should. That's just me experiencing this the way that I think you know I should be experiencing it. Um, but yeah, so I'll, I'm going to be learning as I go. We'll see how this video turns out because this will be the first time I've done anything like this. And without further ado, we're going to go ahead and unwrap the box. Um, now, so, there was a weird cut. Like, someone actually nicked this package before I even opened it. But I don't, I'm not going to, like, be doing an, a real unboxing here. This is just me opening the box <laughs> because I just bought it. Um, we're going to pretty much ignore most of the stuff that's in it. And we're just going to, we're just going to be opening the card. So, we're going to go ahead and put all of this packaging and the player's guide to the side here as well as, I believe, all the stuff in here that is not actually Pokemon cards. So thankfully, from the looks of it, any of the Nicks were kind of in open spaces, so there wasn't a chance of it actually damaging any cards. I might keep these out. I might keep the little sleeves the sleeves out so that I can put any good cards we get in there. But here we go. Here are all of our packs of cards, as well as a giant pack of energies, which I don't think we really need to deal too much with. Um, as well as some nice dividers for when we put stuff back in the box. So it was gonna be says it said it wasn't gonna be an unboxing, and here I am, kind of unboxing it. But yeah, so for the most part, we're gonna put everything that isn't actually opening cards to the side. I believe. Yeah, here's another QR code card. I'm just gonna put that over here. But yeah, so first things first, we have this shining ho card, which is like the special card in the box from what I saw, which is kind of nice. It actually does look really cool and as a fan of shiny pokemon for anyone that actually has seen this channel before um it's really cool to have like some shiny pokemon cards yeah so i'm just gonna i'm not even gonna unwrap this i'm just gonna put this to the side in its packaging and first things first i'm actually gonna open these so i have something to put any decent cards we get in i'm super excited for this guys because like like i said i just really recently got back in to all these Pokemon cards, so it's really been fun to go back and unbox, or un or not unbox, open Pokemon cards, but all right. So let's go, I'm just gonna set all these off to the side over here, and let's get started with our first pack. It's got a shiny Mew on the front. Maybe we can get a shiny Mew in the pack. So here we go. I believe, if I'm remembering correctly, the card trick is what, uh, moving three? Or is it four for... I think it's four for the energy, right? We'll see. We'll see. Either we're going to get, like, a really rare card on the top or we're going to get energy. Okay, I was right. It is the energies. So I'm going to go ahead and put that to the side. Sophocles. Great ball. Try not to move the whole stack at once. Scrafty. Pikachu. Ekans. Tauracats. Breloom. 
uh, Nina, Reverse Hollow Litten. I'm gonna put special, and a Hollow Reshi Ram, which I think is pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool. It's not like you know Rainbow Rare or anything, but that's still a really nice card. And I know that these boxes generally have like really good cards guaranteed, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this one in a little sleeve. Also gonna go ahead and do that with Litten too. I think. So anything Hollow or Reverse, I'm gonna do. And then from there, any card that I really like, I'll put in the sleeves later. I'm going to put like the reverses here and then the rare cards from the packs in their own piles. If I could get them in <laughs> into the sleeves, it's kind of awkward trying to work around the camera, but we'll figure it out. All right, here we go. Our next pack, which is also another shiny Mew. So maybe this one will have the shiny Mew in it. Who knows? Who knows? We'll just have to find out. All right, so we're going to do the same trick again. Put the energy on top. Water. And then here we go. We got Arbok, Super Scoop Up, Sophocles, Voltorb, Gullet, Weasel, Scraggy, Crocona, a Reverse Hollow Gallark. I actually really like the Hollow Purple there. And then what's the last card gonna be? A Shining Genesect. Awesome, awesome. So we did get a Shining in this pack, which I think is. Super cool. I opened a few packs of this before at one point uh, and didn't get any Shinings in it aside from, you know, Shining ho -Oh, but that is what I really want. We got a Shiny in the Pokemon card game, which fits perfectly with this channel, so now I'm not worried that this video will be out of place here. Just kind of kidding with that, but all right. So let's get these in sleeves and then move on to the next pack, which has a Shining Genesect on the front. Perfect. Maybe it's a sign of good things to come. So again, just that QR card. And one, two, three, four. Fairy energy. All right. Pokemon. So now we got Pokemon Breeder, Electrode, Great Ball, Quillfish, Shroomish, Litten, Larvesta, a Purloin. I always keep like thinking that this one's going to be. I keep counting wrong. We got a, a Keldeo. I don't know why I could not think about how to say that it already screwed up my mouth before i even started saying it that is our reverse hollow and then we got a latios as our rare card awesome awesome so let's go ahead and get sleeves on these and move on to the next pack i'm super excited for these guys i know i've said that like three or four times but that's just how excited i am to be opening pokemon cards again it's been too long since i really did a lot of this sorry another mew on the front of the pack it gave us a shining genesect last time so maybe maybe it's a good luck charm but it also was the first pack so all right so those th fronts another fairy energy then we got electrode floatzel arbok scraggy quillfish torkoal minin jinx a reverse spiritum and then a shining jirachi yay yay that is awesome because, like, Jirachi is one of my favorite mythicals. Uh, you know, ge massive Gen 3 fan for anyone that watches the streams. And now I have a shiny one in card form. So there we go. I might not be able to get one in the games, but at least I have one of some kind now. Super awesome. Super awesome. And it's awesome that I'm actually getting some of the shinings this time. Because I didn't get any last time I opened one of these. But I didn't do that on camera. Maybe that's the luck. It's just all the luck on camera. Alright, let's go ahead and get these out of the pack. With that there we go make sure these are all lined up so i don't like get a sneak peek of anything i shouldn't so we got damage mover hal switch ekans pikachu totodile bulbasaur gallet uh reverse is a scrafty and then we have another latios all right all right, can't complain, can't complain. It is still a good pack. I know I didn't have some of those uh, more common cards, which is still, it's still a plus. It's still adding to the collection, which is what matters at the end of the day, right? Like it might not be getting the best pulls, but at the end of the day, we're adding some more cards to the collection and completing it. All right, so now for the next pack with a Mewtwo on the front of it. Let's see, maybe there'll be a Mewtwo in here. Maybe that's, maybe it is, you know, for uh, like forewarning what's gonna happen. Or for seeing, I guess is a better word there. Four to the front. We got ourselves a Dark Energy, Spiritome, uh, Pokemon Breeder, Electrode, 
Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, Stunfisk, Totodile, Litten. The reverse is a Larvesta. That's actually kind of cool. And then we have another, or a Kel uh, Keldeo. I don't know why. I cannot say that one. I cannot say that one for whatever reason. I don't know. I keep wanting to say, like, Kaleidoscope. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know. I don't know. That's just me. I'm just weird like that. All right, let's get these in their sleeves and move on to the next pack. It's got Rayquaza on the front. Favorite shiny legendary. So maybe that'll bring that'll bring us some luck here. All right. So we got an Ultra Ball. Uh, I just the pack slipped and I saw some sparkles. So we know something's good. I wish we hadn't seen that though. It'd been really cool to pull it with like. Complete surprise, but we got a Leopard, Leopard, I know I pronounced that wrong, Volcarona, Minim, Stunfisk, Breloom, Ekans, Gullet, the reverse is Azora, and then we have a Mewtwo GX, awesome, awesome, there we go, moving up, hopefully, hopefully we can get like a full art or something out of this pack, that'd be really cool, but hey, I've gotten two Shinings so far, so I'm, I'm pretty happy personally, so anything else is just a bonus. As long as I can get these in the sleeves. <laughs> I don't know, I struggle to open them sometimes. Some of them are really easy, some of them just don't want to let you put a card in them. So another Rayquaza pack here. So let's see if this one is just as lucky as the last. i try to keep this much more flush this time. So we got our energy. Then we got Leopard again, a Feraligator, Warp Energy, Litten, Larvesta, Breloom, Toracat, Plusle, a reverse Pokemon Breeder, that's actually kind of cool, and what's behind it, another Mewtwo GX, two in a row, both were from the Rayquaza pack, right? That's really crazy, that is insane, two in a row, like, it'd be weird if we got two in the pack already, but to get two in a row, that's kind of, it's kind of cool, we got two more packs left, so here we go, yeah, you know, last but not least type of deal. So let's see if we can end with a bang with these last two guys. I still think it's pretty cool. Two GXs in a row. Alright. Keep these flush. Don't want to spoil anything. So we got Hal, Switch, Carnivine, Gollet, Weasel, Scraggy, Croconaw, Jinx, Reverse Voltorb, and a Raikou. Awesome. Awesome. So let's get sleeves on those. And then we got our last pack, guys. Maybe we can end with, like, you know, maybe a Rainbow Rare, a Full Art, or even a Secret Rare. That'd be super cool. We already got two Mewtwo, so I don't know if we'll be getting the Secret Rare Mewtwo from this. But here we go, guys. Last pack. is another Rayquaza, which gave us two Mewtwo GXs from the other two. So maybe we'll get three. Who knows? Maybe we'll get the other Mewtwo. That would be awesome. But only one way to find out here. So, all right. All right. Let's move these. All right. Let's take this one slowly. So we got the electric energy. We got save of the moment, guys. We got Hal. We got Incineroar. Pokemon Catcher. Totodile. Bulbasaur. Gollet. Croconaw. Litten. Reverse is a Breloom, and then what's the last card? It is a Manaphy, okay. That's not too shabby. All right, all right, guys. So that's all the cards that I have for today. Let's get these last ones in a sleeve real quick, and then we can look through the rares, the super cool cards that we got. And that will be it. But yeah, so let's go ahead and move the reverses, the energies out of the way as well as, I don't know, I think these are in the way. I can't quite see all of the camera right now, so there might these might have just been kind of piling up. Yeah, let's move these out of the way as well. Let's just look through these one last time. So both, so let's look at them this way. Let's look at the first one that we got. The first thing we got was this Reshi Ram, followed by a Shining Genesect, which was super cool, getting that Shining card. Those are what I really wanted. That's what this whole set is about. Then I think the next one, uh, the next one was Latias. I actually thought the next one was this next one. The Shining Jirachi, which like, like I said, I love this mythical, and now I have it in shiny form, even if I can't have it like that in the game. So that's super awesome. I'm super happy about that. 
What's the next one? The next one was another Latios. Which you can't be too upset about. It's still a really nice card. Then we have our Keldeo, which I think I said right that time. We have our Keldeo with the Hollow, which is super cool. I really do like the Hollow on these cards. I even like the Hollow on the reverses, you know, how they have that energy look to them. Then we got one Mewtwo GX, which is super cool in its own right, followed by a second Mewtwo GX, like literally the next pull, which I thought was crazy to get two of them in one pack, and then to get two of them in a row as well is really, really crazy to me. And then, what? The second to last one was a Raikou. And then our last one was a Manaphy, which is super cool. You know, I always, I want one of these in-game, but hey, now, oops, I moved the camera right at the end. Right at the end, I moved the camera. Oops. But yeah, so I've wanted one of these in-game, but hey, at least I can have one as a card now. So, alright guys, that has been, I, I just noticed half of them are off the camera, which is unfortunate. I'll move them up real quick so they can at least have their moment in the spotlight here. There we go, as we end the video. But yeah, so that was the first card unboxing I've ever done and like card opening I've ever done on video. So it'll be interesting to see how this actually ended up turning out. I don't even know, I got way too into it. I don't know if I was even showing you guys the cards right. I may have like had this massive glare coming into the camera for all I know. But yeah, yeah, so that was actually really fun to do. It was really exciting to see all the new cards that, that I got. You know, I can add them to my collection now and hopefully eventually I can like get a pretty solid collection, like have a full set which would be super cool. But yeah, so thank you all to anyone that stuck around till the end here. And yeah, so this has been really exciting. I don't know how I'll, if I'll do it in the future, but if you liked the video, uh, you know, leave a like, you know, comment, tell me what you liked about it. If you didn't like anything, let me know, you know, what I should change, if I should keep doing these. And yeah, so like I said, thank you all for tuning in and I will see you all in the next one.